and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on everybody, it's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video guide. Today I'm going to be going over what you need to be doing first during the Blitz promo. I'm going to be going over all the things you want to be looking out for, all the things you guys want to be uh, kind of on top of, and pretty much what we're going to be doing now. Obviously, as you guys know, I pretty much play Blitz, no money spent. I play most of the game with money spent. Now, that probably will be changing as my channel gets bigger next year and going into Madden 21. So, don't expect this to be the trend forever. I'll definitely end up being a pack guy at some point, but as far as the bank account goes, it really loves me being no money spent so we're gonna keep that up for the time being now i'm gonna go over what i'm gonna be doing first what i'm kind of attacking first in the heart in this promo because i know a lot of you guys are probably confused you're probably overwhelmed especially you guys who aren't youtubers or guys who aren't on twitter you guys are probably so overwhelmed about the fact that there's like a thousand offers a thousand cards a thousand packs all these new colors and things i'm gonna go over everything you guys need to pretty much know what you need to be doing first and what i'm gonna be attacking first as a uh, as a player myself now guys before we get into this video make sure you go down below hit that subscribe button turn that naughty bell boys come join the family we're at 13.2k subscribers. You guys are killing it. We've, we've grown like a thousand this week. Let's see if we can keep it going. Get to 14,000 by maybe even the end of this month. That'd be awesome because we are going for 16 to 17k by the end of December. So our goal is still very in play if we can have a really big end of the month. So guys, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Comment down below what you guys rate the Blitz promo on. I've been asking all my videos. On a scale from 1 to 10, tell me what you rate the Blitz promo. Give me a reason why because I want to see what you guys think. I've been kind of rating all the promos this year. And then also make sure to give this video a huge thumbs up. Can we get 500 likes in this video? You guys have been killing the like button. Yesterday, you guys had, we had crazy support break. We broke our view record on the channel yesterday. So enough said about that. Guys, let's get into the video. So first things first, I'd recommend you first come take a look at the store. Get an idea of what you're looking for. What do you pick what you want right now? So this is for money spenders real quick. So if you're not a money spender, disregard this for a second. So if you're a money spender, pick which bundles you want. Now I did go over in the other video. You're going to see, we're going for the best bundles. I like this one, the 24 gridiron bundle, the legend blitz bundle. That's about the only bundles I like, those three. So it's NF Legend Blitz, Gridiron, and Elite. Now, if you're if you want to just get a little bit of Blitz points, a little bit of decent stuff, you know, a, a decent return on value, right here, it's 25 bucks, 24 Gridiron bundle, solid bundle, half, it's like a fourth of the price. Now, if you want to get some good value, again, Legend Blitz bundle, it's gonna be about $100. You're gonna get a full Legend 91 plus, eight fantasy packs, and four NFL 100 packs, another solid value. So I recommend if you guys are throwing money spent at that, you get some Blitz bolts. Which gives you guys, and the Blitz Bolts are a great return on value to you guys. I'm telling you guys now because, let's say you buy this bundle right here, right? So first off, you're getting a much better value than a typical Legend Fantasy bundle. And you get 12,000 Blitz Bolts, which is like almost half Lamar Jackson. And you can also use that to get more packs. And then you end up just kind of getting more packs. You can essentially get like a total of like 14 to 13 packs just off this bundle using the Blitz Bolts too. Now, look at the players real quick, guys. I'm going to give you a real quick recap of the players I want. And I'd recommend you buy. I think we're also solid. Maybe Kyler Murray, um, Jalen Smith, Robbie Anderson, Lane Johnson. That's about it. Those are the cards that I think that you should target. Now, the reason behind that, I went over that in plenty of other videos. I went over their stats. You guys should already know all this. But pretty much the goal right now is to get as many Blitz Bolts as you can, convert it into value, and then see where you are from there. Now, guys, quick disclosure, full disclaimer, like, disclosure. If you're not a money spender, you're not getting Lamar Jackson. I'm sorry to break your dreams. It's gonna be it's it's impossible. If you're not a money spender, you're not getting Lamar Jackson. Lamar Jackson costs approximately probably about like two hundred dollars. So if you're not spending money now, remember it's not two hundred dollars straight in Lamar Jackson. It's like two hundred dollars to get Lamar, but you also get a ton of bolts, a ton of cards, a ton of token, a ton of sell uh, coins. You get a lot back, so it's not like you're just wasting all Lamar Jackson. But remember, you know money spent, you're not getting Lamar Jackson. So just get that out of the way now. So before we get further in this video, so also the last thing you guys are gonna be looking at is the packs. Now, if you guys are money, sp if you're not money spent, these are still very obtainable. If you guys go play your house rules and your solos and everything, which I'm gonna get over, and you guys get your free stuff and your hourly packs, you're gonna be able to probably get a few Legend Fantasy packs for free. So that's pretty cool. Some a few master tickets, which you probably won't be able to use them for the Lamar. You're not gonna be able to get it, but you can probably quick sell these master tickets after the promo is over for some coin. So that's not a horrible investment right there. As well as the fact that you could get something good out of these. For no money spent, you can really build up your coins using these. Now, if I was no money spent, well, like I mean, myself, like if I was gonna go and I had a, if I had a God Squad though, I'm probably opening up the packs. Now, if I don't have the greatest, the greatest team, maybe I'm getting these players and add some players to the team. And then obviously these bundles only apply to money spent guys. Now. As far as building up your coins to go get those cards or go get those players or those uh, blitz bolts, head over to challenges. There's two ways. There's an online version and an offline version. Now, for all you guys who don't really like playing online or you lose a lot, 
probably where you want to go blitz right here blitz 101 and blitz bash now blitz 101 is pretty simple you can get up to a thousand blitz bolts from the blitz 101 and it's pretty much offline it's like a it's like journey solos gauntlet solos you come in you have requirements play them on three stars or at least if you want to play them on one star you can but then you got to complete the bonuses or play them on two stars complete one bonus or play them on three and have to worry you get some nice coins you're gonna get 26,000 coins and a thousand blitz bolts so it's almost a legend fantasy pack right there then the blitz bash again is going to be two cards let's see what these cards are blitz tug of war these are the house rules i believe yeah each team will get five offensive plays to score be closest possession changes after each play play on harder difficulties for more rewards be careful each star pushes you back further so i guess every time you play you can re-get these rewards so if you guys want you can play it on this maximum and potentially get up to about 600 coins per well 550 coins per plus 25 blitz bolts and this is the offline one this is for you guys who want to play the computer think it's a little bit easier now if this is too boring for you guys who want to play this you guys can play the online one now what would i recommend say for me if you guys want to win every single time probably offline but if you guys want to have like some kind of like mental stability and have fun i'm going to play online most of the more than likely because i find it very boring to play something 100 times like that, especially offline so the other one's going to be the headset season tug of war or whatever it is in the seasons mode right here it's going to be blitz drive switch it up with house rules and a blitz bolt for every win this one you pretty much just start on like an OT, ot type drive they if they score they win if you stop them you win it's very straightforward probably the quickest house rules we've had up to date so first thing i would do like i said is once you get your, your your daily packs and everything always go the first thing when you get into madden check the stores know your times always know your times guys just my best advice i can give you is know that because like last year and the years past when it comes to blitz you guys never knew what was coming out. It was like, you have to just be there at midnight or 8. You have to just come home, skip work, take lunch, just come out and see what's going to be and be ready because it's going to be quick. Now there's no global limits, so you have time to do it. And they know what's coming in advance. So I'd recommend you go there, maybe on your phone, make a little reminder. Be like, okay, so 8 p.m., Legend Fantasy Packs, I definitely want those set o'clock. Set your reminders for the day of what comes out at 1. Make a little calendar so you guys can have an idea of what you want. Now, to get all that stuff, like I said, you no money spent. Obviously, the first thing you want to do is play your solos, your house rules, and get your free uh, daily flash packs. So what I would recommend, like I said, house rules or offline house rules, it's all preference. If you hate playing online, you want to just put up some good Netflix, chill, put some Disney Plus on, relax, and just play. Probably offline. If you want to play online, you want to get a little sweatier now. It's not that, I don't think offline's any easier. I mean, it all depends on who you are. Like, if you're not great at playing online people, like, you're just got to compete to play offline. But for me, I'm pretty good. So online's actually going to be a little easier, I think, for me, because I can just, it's a little more fun, too, knowing that I'm versing an actual human on the other side, and they're getting, like, angry that I'm beating them in comparison to the computer where... If I beat them, I get no pleasure. If they beat me, I'm just really mad. They don't get mad when I beat them because they're, they're, you know, they're AI. So that's pretty much it for that. I mean, like I said, you just want to get in your free Blitz Bolts now. I think probably max, you'll probably get up to like 4,000 Blitz Bolts free with the free packs, the solos, the uh, objectives. I don't really think there's much more room for that because they only give us 25 per. So definitely going to make it really hard to do so. Also, make sure you're purchasing your daily Blitz Pack. It's going to be like right here somewhere. It's going to be 500 coins for 100 Blitz. I recommend you do that. That's a pretty solid deal right there. So if you pick up all that, you could probably end up throwing into Blitz like four to 5,000, which is not going to get you Lamar Jackson or CJ2K, but it could get you like two to three Legend Fantasy Packs or potentially one of the 92 overall players almost. So you can definitely take advantage of that. Not a bad idea. Now, as far as like I said, the Blitz. Now, this one's a little harder just because it is and always will be a money spent promo. The next few blitzes will not be like this. The next few blitzes will have training, it will have more coins, it will have a currency. But this one, this one's just going to be straight up money, 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 money. Now, this one's not as bad as years past. You guys might think it's that bad, but it's really not. In years past, you did not get this much return on value. I think you get a lot of return on value this year. Like I said, like, even if you get Lamar and you have to spend all those blitz bulls, you're going to get a ton of packs. You might make it back. With the price of Lamar and the price of all the packs you get, you could potentially come back with like two to three million coins worth of value for $200 that's really not horrible even um, like if you bought like from a coin sponsor like $200 it's almost a type like that's almost the price of it so that's really not horrible not gonna lie this is one of the better blitz promos in terms of like even I was thinking about spending $200 because you definitely get your coin value back although it is virtual but you, you get the coin value back for it in comparison to like if you bush bulk red iron packs it's definitely not horrible definitely a thinker but like I said you want to be doing stuff first want to be efficient things are time you have to be timed on this so i'd recommend you go over write down all the bundle times so you guys know exactly when they drop write down the blitz bolts packs obviously things drop in intervals here of 12 12 12 12 so there's a new bundle every day it looks like every morning and every night at 12 yeah just about is there two bundles dropping at the same times i mean it appears so 
But yeah, just write down the intervals, know when this stuff comes out, be ready for all that, play your solos, get your blitz bolts. And like I said, with all the extra master tickets that you're left with, you can always just sell those at the end of the promo. They'll probably let you quick sell them. That's about it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video does help you guys with like getting yourself settled because there was a lot to go over in this video. Hope it helps you guys a lot. If you're new to the channel, make sure you go down below, hit that subscribe button, turn that on bell, boys. Can we get to 14,000 subscribers by the end of this month? Which is like like three more days let's see probably not but we might come close comment down below like i said your rating on a scale from one to ten of the blitz promo give me a reason why and make sure to smash the like button can we have 500 likes in this video you guys have been killing it lately let's see if we can keep it going thank you guys so much for watching i'm out see you guys next video peace